remember how to menu. There we go. Okay. All right. <sighs> okay, so we're going to do new game. Yes. I know. All right, so time's going to start now. What? <laughs> it was a question. I wasn't quite sure when time starts. All right. So the basic story the basic story behind Anodyne is that you're this guy right here, and uh, you're kind of like asleep in a coma. Uh, and you're kind of trying to fight yourself to wake up. I don't really remember the story because I've only run any percent for so long, and uh, you don't get much of the story. You'll see why in a minute. This is Sage. Uh, we're not going to talk to him again, but he's telling us that we need to protect the Briar from evil, uh, whoever that is. Or whatever that is. Okay, so as soon as we get in this area, we go to the map and then hit return to entrance. It teleports us past a wall. It just makes it a little bit faster. And then we're going to go out of bounds. Alright, so now we're out of bounds. And uh, we're just going to keep going out of bounds. And that's basically how we're going to finish the game. Uh, it only takes six screen transfers to go out of bounds. But I might be doing more because I haven't, again, I haven't done this in a while. This is a really fun game to pick up and learn. Uh, it takes, I don't know, uh, 15 minutes to learn the the pretty basic any percent route. Uh, and then if you want to learn like the hardcore world record strats for this, uh, it takes a little bit longer to learn. It involves kind of like zombie walking over a hole in the ground that you should be dead if you walk over. I don't do that because I'm bad. All right, so we're, we're supposed to go fight a boss and get our weapon, which is a broom. Uh, there's really cool mechanics in this game that we will just completely ignore again. Uh, instead of using a sword, you use a broom. You use the broom to transfer dust around, like, all of the areas. Okay, now we're super out of bounds, and the game hates it. And, oh, not yet. <clears throat> okay, and now we're going to walk up here, and it's going to immediately transfer us to the next area. So we just skipped getting a key from the boss, and now we are in the next world. Which is pretty fantastic. Okay, so now we're just going to go out of bounds. It's, it's here now, right? Yeah, it's here. Um, so we're going to go straight up out of bounds here. If I recall correctly. Yeah, this is it. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I can try the scary strats. Scary strats? The, okay, I'll try these strats. They might not work. Um, but basically, you want to... Holy crap. Oh! oh. oh. This, is the, this is the... This uh, is This is new. Like, usually you walk all the way around out of bounds, but obviously this is a little bit more of a direct route. Oh, come on, nerd! <laughs> <laughs> this guy... Yeah, so, like I said, it's... That, that was... Nah. He's that, going to stream. Ah, it's super hard. Okay. Nah, I'm, I, I, if I die, I go all the way back to the beginning, and we don't want to walk out of bounds that much anymore. I don't, at least. I don't got it. Um, okay. So, I'm kind of a little bit lost now, but that's okay, because whenever you're lost in Anodyne, you can just walk out of bounds. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Okay, yeah, this is this is the more this is the older route. Uh, you go down here to the wonderful beach, and then you just <laughs> <laughs> you just keep walking out of bounds. Uh, there's a mean bat and some slimes there. Okay, now we're out of bounds again. Of course. Uh, we obviously skipped a level transfer that was in that area, but we're gonna walk up. Do 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 do. I think it's one more after the... Is it this one? Yep, this is it. Thank you, Judgy. All right, and now we're in the final area of the game. <laughs> or no, no, next to the final area of the game. Uh, that was the sage again, if you missed him. Uh, he wanted to talk to us, but we said no. That's why we hugged the wall. Uh, there are more pro strats for this particular area, but I haven't learned them yet. And the, here's the strats for the game. It's just wiggle out of bounds. Okay, so now we're out of bounds. 
Uh, we have a fantastic 8-bit glitch here. Just twerking your way up Dude. Literally twerking. Twerk. Twerk to win. You watched Worcester do it, and that seemed so fun. Super jelly. Okay, so we still got the 8-bit glitch going on, which is going to let us do some weird things, like walk over that bridge that we shouldn't be able to walk over, uh, and then walk up out of bounds here. This is this screen that I just walked out of bounds from is supposed to take you to another area, but it didn't, so we have to go back to the appropriate location in the game for that screen. So we're just going to walk over this way until we go completely out of bounds again, and the map's going to cycle back around. And then we're going to walk down. Nope. Walk down. Okay, there we go. Now this is the final area for the entire uh, world. This is where the final boss fight is supposed to happen. Uh, we can open this up and get the swap room, but we're not going to. All right, so now we're going to walk up out of bounds here. So this is anodyne. <laughs> um, <laughs> It's uh, it's pretty much a really glitchy walk to the finish. Before uh, Judgy figured out that we could just screen wiggle to transfer, we had to transfer using jumps. The best time, so that involved getting the jump boots, um, getting your broom, fighting a boss, and all this other stuff. But now we don't have to do any of that garbage. Uh, I'm you guys. See, ya. Thanks to your See you later, Taba. So this is the location. Uh, you're supposed to pull, like, lava and water, and they're supposed to join up in front of this what? patch of thorns or something. <laughs> uh, again. Oh, my God. Crap, please, right? Anodyne. I will smack you. I don't know this guy's name. I just call him Anodyne. <laughs> this is Anodyne. Uh, he's Anodyning right now. But, uh... The, is it Davis? Uh, okay, so get ready for time. Okay, so this is the final screen of the game, and we get here. That's Briar, who we haven't even met. Oh, your name is Young. That's right. Are you drowning? Uh, yes, because I can't swim. Holy crap, what a chump. I wouldn't last a minute without Briar, apparently. <laughs> Okay, pro strats is actually to hug this wall when you when you get in the water, so that way you, you just stand right there, save all the frames. I thought you said you weren't going to talk to him again. I forgot that he can't. He did, I didn't talk to him. He talked to me because he's a chump. Time. <laughs> <clears throat> 744. 744, that was really bad. Uh, <laughs> so uh, the record for this game, if I am remembering correctly, is like, fi is it 509? Is it in the fours now? It's like four, four fifty-eight. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah. So, yeah, we all didn't think to use Japanese for the text because Japanese is obviously fastest text. Um, so yeah, fast the yeah, you can fast forward the credits. So this is honestly, I really, really, I really, really enjoyed this game uh, when I first bought it. It's a like, wonderful to play through when you're not totally glitching the garbage out of it. Um, there's, there's my broom fighting a slime that we didn't do. Uh, let's see what other screens we can talk about. Okay, that's not really an interesting screen. Okay, that's the uh, giant windmill in a swamp that we didn't go visit. Um, <laughs> I remember that. Uh, this is the first boss of the game that we didn't fight. Oh, here we can we can learn about all the enemies we didn't see. There's slime, the annoyer, uh, the pew pew, the shieldy, seer, mover, on and off, four shooter, slasher, rogue, uh, dog, frog. Um, rotator, person, wall, <laughs> which is actually really terrifying. Yeah. Uh, rat, who is covered up by wall's hands. Gas guy. Uh, silverfish, dasher, roller, washer, dust maid, burster plant. Manager? <laughs> I don't know. Evil manager. Evil manager. Oh, there's also a gigantic, like, uh, there's a gigantic circus section as well. So we have lion, contort, flame pillar, and uh, servants... Uh, then we have Follower, <laughs> Edward, Fisherman, Red Walker, and Hughes. Like uh, Rabbit, Icky, Shopkeeper. Oh, uh, uh, okay, Rank. Goldman, who's hilarious. Maybe we should go visit Goldman. Uh, Goldman is a direct reference to Zelda. 
Um, <laughs> thorax, James, Mushroom, Crixen. Uh, so you got the Chaser. There's, there's. This game has so much depth to it. Like the art style between all the different levels are really great. Those are the Cube Kings. It amazes me that there's all like there's so much. Stuff. There's a lot of content. So and there's there's four them. dungeons in this game. Obviously, or there's four du core dungeons. There's a lot more to the game. Uh, <laughs> thank you for playing the game. Thank you for playing the video game. Um. Yeah, so, and then we can do New Game Plus. I actually want to go see if we can talk to Goldman. He's really funny. Okay, so as you can tell, if I would have died at any point in the run, this is where I would have started, because I hit zero save points. If you don't remember from five minutes ago, <laughs> this is the beginning of the game. Um, and we're going to go find Goldman. Goldman is just chopping bushes. Like, that's all Goldman does. See you later, nerd. See you, nerd. Bye, nerd. <laughs> Okay, so... Are you supposed to go through that door? Yes. Oh, how are you supposed to go through the door? Yeah. Like, you're supposed to go in the middle, but the hitbox of the door is, like, huge, so you can save some frames by just entering it from the side. I guess I'll show you a little bit more of the gameplay of the game as well, since we're kind of just going for extra time here. Um, so this is the broom. Uh, the engraving on the broom pre says press C to sweep. So we are going to sweep the crap out of these guys. Pretty. Uh, right you're up. Uh, that's life. Oh, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Yep, totally makes sense. All right, that was cool. That we're just gonna out of bounds again. <laughs> now we're going out of bounds. I just wanted you to see the broom. The soundtrack of this game, as well, is really, really well done. Uh, it's all very. I don't know. It's really chill and thematic. There's nothing that's like super high and fast paced like even when you're fighting a boss it's just like chill music it's really good really good music direction in the game so shout outs to you guys wonderful devs alright so we're gonna go out of bounds again cause I don't wanna fight the first boss cause he's a chump we're gonna go find gold man chump or chump lord? chump just a chump okay he's actually the first time I played this game uh I thought, like, oh man, this boss seems to have a really slow starting cycle, so I just ran up to him with my broom and started just trying to destroy him, and it's I one-cycled him the first time I played the game. Um, so if you speedrun games, this is actually... Oh, crap! Oh, come on, game. Oh, no. I went up too soon. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Teach me... Roman, please. Teach me to anodyne. Oh, garbage butts. Um... <laughs> Dude, I... Yeah, okay, so here's the thing with Out of Bounds is you have to, uh... There you go. I guess I can do it up here. You have to have a screen transition. Yeah, I have to have a screen transition by wall. So I'm actually not sure what this Out of Bounds is going to do. Boop. Okay. Um, oh, okay. I extra trap myself. That was super <laughs> smart. All right, we'll go back this way. This game is amazing. I love this game so much. I really need to play it more. I'm going to say the judge's fault for leaving the room. Yep. Okay. All right. I, 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 we're back where we were. All right. Yeah, yeah. Clap up. <clears throat> Nobody. Thank you. <laughs> Clearly we need to clap. <laughs> well, clap is not actually clapping, so I was just doing this. Cause... Oh, my God. Is everybody just going <laughs> to... <laughs> my emote experience. Oh, hey. <laughs> There's writing scrolled on this rock. An explorer is you. That's new. Oh, man. It should not be there. I think that's them. Judge used. Since I already finished the game and reloaded it, you, you technically have the ability to, like, the written ability to go out of bounds anywhere in the game. Like, uh, one of the broom modifiers that you get in the game is called the swap broom. So you can grab any tile on the screen and swap it with another tile. So, yes. So, uh, that is a designed thing. Uh, that's, that's part of the game. So, like, over here... You could grab this tile, drop it over here, and then walk. <laughs> um, so that's one of the reasons why the out of bounds areas are rendered and they wrap the way they do because they expected the character to make uh, to explore out of bounds with that mechanic. Yeah, it's pretty. Yeah, yeah, these guys are great, and they're working on another game as well, uh, which the name escapes me. Do you remember? They posted on the forums. <laughs> Um, okay, so now we need to find Goldman, which was like the whole point of this expedition, and I'm trying to remember where Goldman is at. Oh, on this silly, silly map. 
I think he's up. Oh yeah, he's up this way. Uh, Goldman is also the fighter of the Silverman. I don't know. I tried for a joke and I was really bad. <laughs> yes. Oh my god, get wrecked. Shout outs to competitive Yoshi's Cookie. <laughs> right, so this is again more just more out of bounds. We're trying to find Goldman, who's being a total scrub. Scrub or scrub lord. Scrub. Oh, we can show off one of the other core mechanics of the game here that we totally skipped. Uh, one of the goals of the game is to collect cards. Uh, I believe this is a card. Oh no. What the <laughs> <laughs> That wasn't a card. Uh, I don't know what that was. Oh man. Goldman is being a really ridiculous jerk right now. Well, uh, it's nobody. It's we haven't. I mean, I don't know where Goldman is on the map. I don't know if Judgy knows where Goldman is on the map. Okay, we'll just. Huh? Nope. Nope. You don't know. All right. There's Grumpy Fish. Yeah. He really doesn't like cats. Oh, <laughs> this is a dungeon. Uh, so we just went from overworld to dungeon in one screen. What? Oh yeah. my god, what? Wow. How yeah. in the world does that... Yes. What? Because it's the best. It might be a it's the best. Okay, I transferred back. It's the best. It's Deebs. Totally. Okay. We'll keep hunting. So, shout outs to... Uh, I, he hasn't run it in a while, but shout-outs to Hasdaga, who has the 100% record for this. The 100% run for this is about 30 minutes, 36 minutes now. Uh, it involves using the swap brush. It's like a New Game Plus category, so you use the swap brush to go out of bounds. It was really fun to watch him route it, so give him a follow, twitch.tv slash Hasdaga. And again, supporting Glitch Hunters. Give this guy back here, twitch.tv slash tjudgyk. Give him a follow. I like spelling out his name in chat. To Judge Cook. Yeah. All right, dude. Then he always corrects me. It's just judgy. By the way, to all streamers, just letting you know, <laughs> after the marathon's over, uh, apparently backer, um, the backers of uh, Broken Age can now download the first act. Yeah. Came out today. Yeah, it just came out this morning. Sweet. So, yeah. Now you have something to do. Now the marathon's on ending. Wow. Well, I think I think I lost gold, so, man. Um, don't die or anything? Uh, I won't. Oh, I'm about to die? Oh, here, let me fix that. Okay. The next game this team was working on was called Even the Ocean. Even the Ocean, that's right. Even the Ocean. Wants even to the destroy ocean you. Or even, even, even the Ocean. Okay. <laughs> we'll kill you. Oh, here we go. <clears throat> this is the other mechanic. Uh, I picked up some dust with my broom, and now I can walk on water. Totally sick. Yep. Like I said, there's a whole lot more to this game than I got to show you. Literally, where is Goldman? Basically, Goldman's funny because he's just sitting there, like trying to chop bushes, and he's like, "Oh man, I have to work all day to get to get ruffles from these bushes so that I can feed my family." Oh, here's the item shop. <laughs> Clearly, this game knows how to Zelda. <laughs> All right, we're back. Yay. So yay! Yeah. Um. So that was Anodyne. <laughs> uh. <clears throat> and now it's going away. That makes you sad. Bye, Anodyne. If you are interested in this game, you should buy it. It is usually on Steam Sale, and it's fantastic. Yay, or Steam Humble Sale! Bundle. Or Humble Bundle. Yeah, see, that's the problem. I don't think you should buy it during a Steam Sale, because I have 
get to play a single game on Steam. Uh, 